Hey, what's up? This is Michael Locke with ML Web Consulting. Thanks for checking out this video. I'm going to walk you through today how to um, go about creating contact forms or web forms for your for your website. And generally, this is uh, what you're looking at now is my contact page on my website. And generally, people, uh, if you're building your own website, uh, this is a um, a common question to ask is how do I go about creating a form because um, you're going to always want a web form on your page so if someone comes to your 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 website generally they all you always have a best practice is that you always have a contact page and on that contact page you're going to have <clears throat> excuse me you're going to have a web form uh, something like this uh, in addition to the ability to email you okay and so what you see here on my contact page I have a web form um, that when you you fill this out or if you hit submit without filling it out it'll go to a um, incomplete form page you know but if you fill this out let's see Michael Locke or Michael testing you, you submit this it goes to a thank you page and then it's routed to an email yep there it is and so that test I just ran comes to my email inbox and I get the information okay and generally this is what uh, people want and so how do I do that um, very simple um, I do that by using a tool called relevant tools okay relevant tools allows me to to go in and easily create a web form you know I just go in and I create a database I create a database like uh, I might say for for my contact page I'll go and I'll tell relevant tools that I want a, um, a database called um, contact form so then anyone that fills out this form the information gets sent to the, to, um, the database as well as um, a copy gets sent to me through email okay and so just go ahead and sign up you can go and sign up for relevant tools it's a free 30-day trial don't worry about the design I know it's kind of like dated but um, I've been using this now for like 10 years and um, it's a very cool tool the, the benefit for relevant tools is that um, they allow you to create multiple databases uh, I believe it's it's ten dollars a month for a basic a basic um, basic membership and then thirty dollars a month for unlimited so you can have unlimited databases and uh, and um, a higher amount of of of, uh, of data um, stored in in the databases for for that price and I, and the price goes up based on what what you need so the cool thing about relevant tools is that when you when you log in I mean when you when you create your databases you can create your web forms and then it obviously spits out um, the HTML code for you so you can you know you can go in there and say I want name last name email and different types of information and then you can it'll export the the actual form for you and then you can then copy and paste that into your HTML page um, code okay like like here like um, so like this is my contact form and this is the actual code behind that page I just go to the relevant tools they give me some of the, some code that looks like this and then I would come in here into my form paste it in here and then test it and in my form I can I can then style my form however I want using CSS or whatnot okay and so the other thing the other good thing about relevant tools is that when you start capturing data on your forms and you can create unlimited forms all the forms on my website have been done with um, my one account so I can have unlimited forms on my account I can have other web forms on on other client accounts that I that I um, that I maintain so the cool thing is that I can I can create one account in relevant tools and I can create unlimited databases for 
many of my clients. When, once you capture that information into a database, let's say um, my contact form information, I can then use relevant tools to send out to, to do my email marketing. And what they do, you know, they you can send emails out and uh, they do um, click through. Uh, they give you click through data and all that type of information. And um, it's it's an easy way to send out HTML emails. So it has it all it do, pretty much do a lot of things all in one. The other tool that I haven't used lately, but I've come into to kind of know that these guys are really good at, at doing email forms as well is a site called email me form now they look a little bit more up to date and very easy right you sign up you create your form and um, you copy and paste the HTML code into your site and you're done okay and you can sign up for free and get the free trial I believe um, both with relevant tools and email me form they allow you to um, sign up for a free account but then they obviously you know have have like their logo at the bottom of the form or something like that or powered by you know but then for for email me form I believe you can um, if you pay if you pay yeah the free account but then if you pay 995 a month you can get unlimited forms and, and uh, uh, unlimited maximum fields and things like that so it's a little bit cheaper than relevant tools but um, relevant tools allows you to do the email marketing portion of it and that's um, so you're paying a little bit more for, for that capability and that feature so there there are tons of uh, these I gave you two products relevant tools and email me form um, but there are um, today I would not uh, you know doing web design now for 14 years I have not um, done, done any coding of any forms myself through PHP or anything like that because there are tons of third-party products that actually do this for you better and uh, save you uh, tons of time so um, why waste your time trying to do it all yourself when you can use these you can easily pay a, a few dollars and, and use these third-party tools to um, to accomplish this for you okay so that's um, how to create an email form on your website and uh, hopefully I've answered some questions maybe I can go over everything but if you have any any other questions shoot me an email mlock at mlwebco.com and um, I'll be happy to answer it for you okay we'll talk soon take care